Hello viewers, this is your Michael from Screen Reviews, bringing you a new podcast for my seven, my seven called The Borgtown Review. And like always, I'm going to speak very loudly, very clearly, and very slowly, and very well, in case you don't, uh, in case you don't understand me. Also, I'll try to do my best not to reach your heart during this audio podcast recording as well, not to cause any audio feedback as well. And finally, if you're under 18, this, uh, this audio podcast will, <laughs> World change or adult language. So once again, if you're under 18, that's all your podcast recorded world change or adult language. So anyway, let's get into the latest episode of Boruto. So anyway, so anyway, so anyway, Boruto and the old Kenji Kage managed to get out of the special training ground. Out of special training ground. And that's when, and that's when the old, and that, that's when the old the old Tinji Kaki's brain, why he, he fully explained what happened to his grandson Kakiji and why he created the ox in the first place. While he was explaining to Boruto his motive to making the ox and what happened to his grandson, no, the ox, Kayu and the rest of the ox managed to take over the stone business, managed to take over the stone business. So basically, while, while the old Tinji Kage was, you know, which his story to his his whole story uh, his own uh, was to bring himself to Boruto. So anyway, so basically, Lord Kagu and the rest of the Ox took over the uh, took over the stone bed. So basically, you know, so basically, so basically, so basically, the old Kitty Kage said that you know during the last. Uh, during the last great ninja war, really, really de- de- uh, devastated, you know, all, all, uh, really devastated the stone, uh, the stone bed, the shinobi and whatnot. So basically, you know, so basically that, you know, during that war, you know, they had to rebuild the stone bed. So basically the hideout, the hideout, the hideout that, you know, the hideout slash lab, for the ox, so actually was actually oh was actually the old stone it was the old stone village <laughs> that that they're using for the hide for the for for the for the lab for, for the lab slash hide up for the ox and whatnot. So anyway, the old Tinsy Carter is saying, you know, you know, he is saying explained that his his grandson Kazuki had dreams to recover the cargo. So basically, like you know, blah blah blah. So basically, after one uh, after. Um, so basically, like you know, so basically, like you know, so basically, he was happy, you know. He so basically, his his girl, so basically, the old kid is kind of bad song. Kazi Kazi Ying, Kazi Ying is on. I'm sorry, I'm pronouncing his name wrong. If I am, so please forgive, please forgive, please forgive me. Kazi Ying will have dreams to become the next Kazi Kage until 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 one day, some group of marvelous still try to steal some secrets from the stone. He, his strategy tried to stop was tried to stop the robbers all by himself, but he ended up being badly injured. So basically, so basically, when the old Tiki Kaki got word of well, what happened to his grandson, he rushed to the hospital to be by his grandson's side. So basically, like you know. So basically, you know, that, you know, so basically on his, on his grandson's dying deathbed, you know, he said that, he said that, you know, I have a gene, he said, well, I have a gene, he, he, my grandpa, he told, he told, he told his grandpa that I had a dream if, if one Monday, if I come to Chicago, you know, I will, you know, everything, every, every, we will finally be at peace and whatnot, there'll be no need to war and whatnot. So basically, that was the last time, you know, and that's the last dying. So basically, that's the last dying word of the old Tinti, of the old Tinti, of the old Tinti Kage, uh, grandson. So basically, he died on deathbed. So basically, that's when the, that's when, the, that's when you know, that's when you know. After that, you know, the old Tinti Kage was never the same. So basically, that's when he came up with the idea to create the ox and whatnot to attack his people, to attack or or everybody in his village and whatnot. So basically, it turns out that turns out that he used some sample from white zetsu to correct the art. So basically, like you know, so basically, him and the doctor, you, the doctor must to get some samples of white zetsu to correct the ox. 
and also and also uh, also so uh, Cindy also Cindy yeah K uh, also Cindy K U K U uh, uh cool Colin uh, Colin uh, Colin and uh, and uh, and 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 cover you so basically so basically they managed to took the so basically the old Cindy Carter and the doctor managed to talk some. <laughs> took some samples from white sets to 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 create to create all the arts and also uh, cover you uh, uh, cool sock sock calling and uh, calling and and, and and what uh, and uh, uh, and hot cool and shit. So anyway, so basically thought that turns out that you know turns out that he's the uh, kind of even though even though the even though the ox was. But don't downside about about the about the about the ox about the ox is that you know they don't really last too long. So basically, they since Rosie Marvel, you know, bigger since Mickey is a personal artist, it's a personal artificial human. They you know they need Mickey Mickey G to be too stable to stay with K U and the rest of the ox. That way, that that way, you know, that way. They Never said no on the process to making more arts, uh, making more arts and shit. So basically, so basically to make the arts permanently stable. So basically, so basically the old Kinky Carter said the only purpose of the arts, arts in my in, in my core KU is to attack the Stone Village, not to not to conquer any other village to attack everybody in the Stone Village. That is their only purpose. They're just instruments of protection only. So basically, both are both are saying that. I you worry about them being being internet uh, being you know inter, uh, internet of uh, uh, you know being weapons or, or only the uh, only the uh, only force detected. So basically after so basically both to after seeing sunk after seeing sunk and cover you in action, he he say that, you know, they do have personalities they do have personalities. They're just not they're just not like this thought, you know, but they're not just, you know, you know, both are saying that, you know, after seeing KU the rest of the ox in action, rest of the human ox in action, that, you know, they're just not, they're not just minus, minus artificial creatures, you know, they do have personalities, they do have words of their own. So basically, you so basically, because the old Kitchen Carter is like, you know, uh, was disagreeing with Bonto on that subject, like, you know, you know, KU and the, and the rest of the human ox are just, are just artificial creatures designed to attack to, to attack people at the stone but that's that's their only purpose. So anyway so anyway <laughs> So anyway, back in the stone village, you know, back in the stone village, you know, Shigadai was to was was finding the hard time, have finding the hard time to get out of the stone village and try to get the explanation that he get, you know, try to to you know, try to get the explanation that he learned what the hell was going on in the stone village back to the hidden leaf village somehow. So basically, you know, Shigadai was trying to get out of the stone village to try. To get to try to get word to the hidden leaf, but it's what the hell is going on in the stone village. So anyway, anyway, K U who K K U K U K U had 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 you know had the ox run up five humans to you know to use to to use to help figure out figure out how to you know rule Mishi's curse marking shit. So basically, like I said, the doctor said he needs five human hearts. So that way he can figure out how to be, remove Mishi's <laughs> how to figure out to re remove Mishi's curse box that that is pointed next to Mishi's heart and whatnot. So anyway, so anyway, so basically the so basically. <laughs> So basically, you know, so basically, cover you and the rest of the human ops managed to wind up the people that they need to you know, help with their own Mickey situation. So anyway, so basically, but Kayu said we won't do anything until we find uh, until we find the uh, find the old Kiki Kage. So basically, uh, uh, Haku, Haku was like you know, well, like you know, well, like we should take care of this problem now. So basically, like you know, we should. 
we should move on the spell, but well, can you say that? Uh, t like he said, can you say the uh, to to uh, 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 Haku and the rest of the Hebrews that you know we won't do anything until we find the old Kenji Kage? So basically, so basically he ordered uh, he ordered crew and the rest of the Hebrews to find the old Kenji Kage and bring him back here safely, and then and, uh, and then we, uh, and, and, and let him decide. What, uh, so let him decide. Let him decide how we to search, proceed to from the, uh, you know. So basically, like this. So basically, that you know, call you say that we we need to find the old Tindikage first and bring him back here and let him decide how we go about about uh, about uh, how we deal with Miski. So basically, uh, so basically, uh, Ku is like, all right, then you know, they follow the orders uh for uh Ku and. And that's when Haku showed up, and that's when Haku showed up and found Boruto and the old Tichikage, uh, uh, you know, together, and 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 this is how the episode ended. Where where uh, where Ku showed up, where showed up where showed up where uh, showed up where Boruto and the old Tichikage were, and this is how the episode ended. Where Crew staring at Boruto and and the old Kiki in the old Kiki Kage in the old Kiki Kage staring at Crew. So basically, this is how the episode ended. So anyway, this episode was not bad. So anyway, so I and I know probably I don't know if the, I don't know if next week episode will oh uh, next week episode will air because you know being Christmas Eve. So next week will be Christmas Eve and whatnot. So basically, I'll probably do next week. Episode so I'll probably do next week episode Borto late because of the whole Christmas holiday and whatnot. So anyway, so basically next week my next to be on on episode twenty on the episode eighty seven of Borto will probably be on a, a Wednesday because of the whole Christmas holiday. So basically like no just to let you guys know my next my next review on Boruto episode eighty seven will probably be on Wednesday because of Christmas you know because of Christmas Eve and Christmas Day so basically you know I'll probably do my review do my Boruto review on episode twenty uh, episode eighty seven on a Wednesday so anyway just to let you guys know anyway this is Cynthia Michael from School Reviews wishing you guys all a happy happy holiday so anyway sign off one. Thank <laughs> you.